Hello and welcome to another video and in this video we're going to take a look at the Anwes smart contact sensor. Now I do have a review about the Tuya smart contact sensor as well. If you're interested, the link is in the description. Now the first thing that you'd notice is that the box is really nice done and it looks like a quality item. But let's see what's inside the box and check it out. Now, this is everything what you get in the box, the contact sensor, the magnet, some stickers, the user manual, and these little Lego things in case that your door or window has not the same height. Now, I'm not going to use the Apple HomeKit directly, but instead of that, I'm going to use the Anvis Home app and see if it's going to work. So I'm going to add a new device. Now it's done. That was really easy. Let's see if it's going to work. Now I'm going to close the magnet to the sensor and see if it's going to notice that. Closed, yes, and now still closed, still closed, now it's open. Now this one, it works very good and it's more sensitive than the Tuya Smart Sensor and the quality is obviously much better than the other one. Now the difference between this sensor and the other sensor from Tuya Smart is that this one works with Apple HomeKit and the Tuya Smart works with Wi-Fi. That means if you don't have an Apple TV or a HomePod or an iPad as a home hub, you can't really reach this sensor when you're away. Now that was it for this video again. I hope you like it and it was helpful. Please do let me know in the comments if you also have an honest contact sensor and what was your experience with that. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and sharing this video with your friends. Thank you again so much for watching and see you next time.